Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Alex Fresco and in this video we will start to see the modifiers. We have seen already how to create geometries. Now it's time to go in the main menu here on the left, select modify. I have already drawn a couple of geometries so we can play with these in the meantime. And as usual, we will start from the top with this video, so we will see move and uh, we will work our way down. Let's immediately start to see how we can uh, move or the same command. So move is also used to copy geometries around. So first thing you have to do is uh, select the geometry you want to move. So you select it, you go here, move, you select the function. At this point, as you can see from the right, right panel, you need to specify the starting point. So which one is uh, the reference point of your uh, movement? So you can select uh, uh, this corner, that corner, the center, you know, you can uh, use the, the snap. Re remember, there is a video specified uh, just talking about all snaps, what they are and what they are used for. So if you missed it, check it out. Now we want to move so starting point I don't know it can be anywhere it doesn't really matter I mean unless you want to move it you know from a specific point to another specific but I can even just click somewhere in the area and as you can see I can move it whenever I click again the software is gonna drop it so here it is now, like I was saying, we can use the OSNAPs if, you, if we want to move and maybe connect. Let's say I want to grab the midpoint of this uh, pentagon and I want to place it right on the tip of this uh, star. So I can select it, go and select move function, select midpoint. So as you can see, it's going to highlight the midpoint. And now I can go there and select the end point. I want to place it on the end point of one of, of one of the lines here. So here, that's it. But uh, as mentioned before, we can uh, also use the same function in order to copy geometries. So how we do that? Easy peasy. We can select the star go again and select the function move we select uh, any reference point for the movement i'm just gonna click somewhere here in the working area so here and then before dropping it so before clicking the second time we can enable the copy here on the right using the right panel now we will see that when I click again, it's going to create a copy. And as you can see, I'm already copying it a second time, unless I decided to not, to not do it. And so I'm going to clo close the, the function, clicking on undo or pressing escape on the keyboard. Let's see and let's repeat this uh, process for uh, the pentagon as well. This time we are going to copy the pentagon twice. So we will have three pentagons at the end. We can select, move, enable copy. At this point we can drop it two times. One here and I don't know, one here and then close the function. 
this is it for this video. In the next we will see how to rotate geometries. Don't miss it and thank you for watching. See you the next time.